appendix out on Drag City Records. What did you come in for? What is she going? What is she coming for? Hey. Came in for the phone. No respect at all. Sorry, that was uh, a track from Appendix Out on Drag City Records, the LP Daylight Saving, and the track was called Foundling. Now, let's see what... Uh, Lynn has actually written rather a lot about Half Man, Half Biscuit, but I'll read it out anyway. The acerbic post-punk outfit Half Man, Half Biscuit was formed in Birkenhead in 1984 by singer-guitarist Nigel Blackwell, his guitarist brother Cy, bassist Neil Crosley and drummer Paul Wright. In 1985, they entered the studio to record their debut LP back in the DHSS, which became a Peel favourite and seemingly overnight Half Man, Half Biscuit became stars of the British Independent independent music scene. The album quickly grabbed the top spot on the UK indie charts and eventually ranked as the best-selling independent record of 1986. The Trumpton Riot CP followed back in the DHSS to number one, but Half Man Half Biscuits shunned the spotlight. They refused several offers to perform on television, and while enjoying a major hit with the single Dickie Davis Eyes, announced their breakup in the autumn of 1986. A collection of B-sides and unreleased material back again in the DHSS followed a year later. Then in 1990, the Blackwell Brothers and Crossley reformed the band, issuing the LP McIntyre, Treadmore and Davitt in 1991. This is Half Man, Half Biscuit. I'm wheezing a bit, aren't I? I do apologise for that. I'm trying not to, but there you go. Uh, this is Half Man, Half Biscuit's sixth Peel session. The first was back in 1990 and follows the release of their new single, Look Dad, No Tunes. At the moment, they're busy recording some new B-sides with Bernard Butler. Bernard Butler? And uh, is that a joke? Is that true? Or is that a joke? It's true, I think. It's true, is it? Good Lord. And they'll be kicking off a nationwide tour in December, supporting the Tinder Sticks. But before that, because you don't know which of these things they've made up, but before that, they'll be playing the Horn St Albans on the 6th of October, some pub they don't know the name of in High Wycombe on the 7th of October, a college annex of some sort in Todmorden on the 22nd of October, and the Climby Fisher Memorial Gravel Quarries, Bridport, Dorset, on the 11th of November. I don't really believe that last one, but anyway, always uh, very welcome on the programme, as regular listeners will know. Half Man, Half Biscuit, and the Offington Wassail. Walking across the forecourt of the fire station My weariness consumes me yet still protects me from The dimmer switch in the membership of Britannia Music Club I adventured for a fortnight in the valley of the Rhone Defied capricious mistrals on which tragedies are blown Dismounting at the roadside to lubricate my chain I heard the hounds of retribution barking their refrain Singing, let's go the map bar and cause an altercation Let's go to Groucho's and snap at Rakish Hill I went all floppy just to see where I'd end up The morgue was my considered guest Though maybe Martinique The stern grind of reality however took its course I stayed exactly where I was and suffered endless felts Because you had a daughter and chose to call her Rain Because you didn't indicate to go down Woodchurch Lane Your Amdram class has been postponed indefinitely Cause the root of Jesse's just turned up in glorious majesty Singing sealed, not society Let's see you try and do this one Luton Town, Millwall, 1985 <laughs> Israel. Late lunch, honey, we've got a 
Well, I laughed out loud at least three times in the course of that. Half man, half biscuit. On good form as always, and that's called Uffington Wassail. And this is Scientist. <laughs> And here's another tune from Half Man, Half Biscuit.
supreme in all the world, really. Half man, half biscuit in session, and that's called Gubba Lookalikes, uh, Tony, of course. And uh, it's a strange thing because, uh, even, I mean, I have a lot of listeners in Germany to various programmes that I do, and uh, a lot of them are crazy for half man, half biscuit. And ditto people who listen to these programmes and others that I do again in uh, Finland and in the United States of America as well. And from the United States of America, this is from uh, Audio Dregs Records from Portland, Oregon, and it's by the Sensualists. And after this, it'll be the P. Lenium, if we can find the voice, who seems to have gone AWOL. This is called Spatial Bodies. <laughs> There are so many things on here that might be the name of the band or could be the title of the tracks and there's absolutely no clue to it at all. I mean, it says, pick up a Lab Farm performance, so they could be called Lab Farm, then it says, jog brains, it looks like, and then lots of other bits and pieces all over the sleeve and uh, their address is 116 Stanford, Lake Jackson, Texas, 77566. Perhaps you can write to them and find out more. That's uh, 116 Stanford, Lake Jackson, Texas, 775. 66 USA. I'd love to know more, uh, but the band's name, according to them anyway, it says on the front, I suppose they ought to know, is Stay There Lassie, Don't Try To Move, I'll Get Some Help, You're My Favourite po Poem, You're My Favourite Pony. And the title of the track, well, I can't give you that at all. Here's another one from Half Man, Half Biscuit in session for us again tonight. This is Bottleneck at Capel Currig. We didn't see the summer sun. We didn't speak to anyone. and surely the first song to mention Capel Currig. That's Bottleneck at Capel Currig, Half Man, Half Biscuit in session. One more from them for the end of the programme, and according to Anita, the producer, it's the best. It's well, difficult to see how that can possibly be the case, but I look forward to it anyway. And uh, Andy Kershaw back, of course, tonight at midnight, and I'm sure this is something of which he would approve. from Germany on Monica Records, and that's called Schiefgarten. And uh, I should apologise, really, for having been rather subdued tonight, but it's the lack of emails, coupled with uh, extraordinary fatigue, to be honest. But uh, I should be as bright as you like next week, for sure. And uh, this is uh, the last one from Half Man, Half Biscuit, and it comes with the recommendation of Anita, the producer. This is 24-Hour Garage People. I fancy I'll open a stationer's Stock quaint notepads for weekend pagans While you were out at the Rollwright Stones 
I came and set fire to your shed Cause you probably work at an all-night garage You probably work at an all-night garage You probably work at an all-night garage With talk radio on You curse my soul if I don't want petrol You curse my soul if I don't want petrol I only came down for a tube of Pringles Sour cream and chives Because you gotta get up off your fat ass to go and get my crisps Your scowl increases And when you come back you toss them into that metal tray device thing that separates us And you say £1.33 As opposed to That'll be £1.33 please sir This is done to annoy me of course but has the opposite effect of amusing me Because now I've got loads of other things to buy And plenty of time on my hands I'll have two scotch eggs and a jar of marmite Two scotch eggs and a jar of marmite Two scotch eggs and a jar of marmite What sandwiches have you got? Well now he's getting really irate And from behind the strengthened glass his voice seems to be getting louder And he starts to sound like Lead Belly at the depot I got cheese I got ham I've got chicken, I've got beef, I've got tuna sweet corn, I've got tuna sweet corn. I'll have ten Kit Kats and a motoring atlas, ten Kit Kats and a motoring atlas, and a blue CD on the Hallmark label. That's sure to be good. Okay, boy, let me hear you spell Wilmslow. <laughs> so seven seconds to go. I was waiting for the other seven seconds. Magnificent half man, half biscuit, and twenty four hour garish people, and uh, ten kid cats and a motoring atlas. I said, "Well, there you go. What a great band." This is uh, from this is from the Straight Jackets. Uh-huh. 